if a rocket going to the moon was off course from a mere one degree from when it left the Earth. It missed the moon by 6,709 kilometres, twice the diameter of the moon. In the same way, it's a mere one degree that separates those who are living life they want to and those that aren't. Growing up, we learn how to live a certain way, taught to us by our family, our friends, our environment, taught to us by society of what we can and can't do. Over time, we end up buying into the limitations of others. And the result, one of the biggest tragedies of our time, the fact that most people underestimate what they can truly do with their life. It was Albert Einstein who once said that the most important decision we make is a choice to believe that we live in a friendly or a hostile universe. What Einstein was saying is that the road to living a fulfilling life starts with a choice. A choice to believe that we can live the life that we want to or not to believe. When things happen that we don't want to happen, we often get stuck in wondering why. Why me? Complaining about how things are not the way we want them to be. Yet we forget the fundamental truth. The results and outcomes are there for us to learn, grow and evolve. Life can be summed up by a series of choices, one after another. And a choice simply leads to an outcome. It's then our responsibility to look at the results we're getting, to readjust, realign, recalibrate, and ask again. To make the necessary course correction, one degree at a time, to get us from where we are today to where we truly want to be. But our choices need to be grounded in a deep understanding of what we want for our life. What is the point of course correction if we don't truly know where we're going? People are constantly wanting more. And this longing comes from a deep sense of lacking something in life. Focusing on the outer world rather than the inner world, which leaves most people chasing things they believe they want. More money, bigger house, fancy car, and a long list of things that will never truly satisfy their hunger for more. But what if you turn that around? choosing to focus on your inner world, you'll learn that what you focus on you create and what you seek, you'll find. And it all starts with a choice. A choice to believe that life is happening for us, not to us. A choice to follow your dreams, to realize that opportunities and possibilities are abundant. A choice to activate your truest potential. So my question to you is, what choice will you make that will take you one degree closer to living the life you truly desire?